And welcome back. It's 642. It is said that a picture is worth a thousand words, but the time for talking about the artwork planned for a downtown church has ended. The painting has begun. And this week's If These Walls Could Talk, Katrina Weber revisits this long-awaited mural project to give us an update. by the sound that things are looking up at Travis Park Church. Months of planning have given way to painting on a massive mural project. I never thought that I would get such a huge wall. Fortunately, Raisa Melendez isn't alone. She's one of six artists chosen in a citywide search to help spread the church's message of love and acceptance. I chose Black Lives Matter and I also intertwined the religious theme to it by adding a cross. Each panel features a different design, but with a common goal, letting people know all are welcome here. As we showed you earlier this year, the downtown church launched the project to coincide with its 175th anniversary. I couldn't believe that I was selected among so many incredible artists. Haley Marmalejo is relatively new to the mural game. She's hand painting her story of empowerment with a nod to Latino culture. Spray paint, meanwhile, was the way to go with Albert Gonzalez's message about resilience. We see this flower go through this really tough time and it gets replenished with water, being a symbol of that love and faith. For some of these artists, this has been a real learning experience. They say it's one thing to design a mural on canvas, but when they're up in these lifts and painting on such a grand scale, that's a whole different world. Just excited to get it done and get it up. We have so many people walking by that are just taking pictures and talking to us. It just really shows like the power of art. That may be just what the church had in mind. Katrina Weber, KSAT 12 News.